Welcome to Accelerate, a DLA Piper hosted series focused on AI. During the series, we will help demystify the complexities of AI regulation, risk, and how to harness the opportunity that AI brings to businesses across the globe. Hello, my name is Gareth Stokes, technology partner at DLA Piper and co-chair of our AI practice. I wanted to talk about the difference between proprietary and open source AI systems. There are a whole series of, of AI models available which can be licensed from vendors who provide cloud access on subscription terms in exchange for a payment. There are separately a whole series of models which are in, you can go and download all of the files, the weights and biases that make up the AI and use those in accordance with particular license terms that allow you to use, uh, modify, uh, and redeploy and share uh, those weights and biases with a wider community. Now, open source purists may get excited about the extent to which some of those licenses include restrictions that might sit outside of the purest possible definition of open source AI. But for ease of taxonomy, the models where you're able to download the whole set of weights and biases, redistribute those, pass them on to third parties, modify them, those would be open source AI by any sensible definition. And AI systems that you access, usually only via an API, don't get access to the weights and biases on cloud terms. Those would be the traditional proprietary AI systems. Hopefully that distinction has been useful. Thank you. Thank you for listening to this episode of Accelerate by DLA Piper. For more on AI, check out our YouTube channel for more videos like this and click subscribe to stay informed. You can also take a look at our AI focus page, dlapiper.com, for further insight and thought leadership and get in touch direct to discuss how we can support you in navigating the complexities of AI. Mm -hmm.